Hey again! For today's short beach safety tip, we're going to talk about longshore currents. Longshore currents are strong currents that are parallel to the shoreline. They are strongest when waves break at an angle in the surf zone and are enhanced by shore parallel winds. For the beaches along the lower Texas coast, they are usually oriented from south to north as we often have persistent southerly winds that contribute to waves breaking at an angle along our shoreline. Even though longshore currents are similar to rip currents and that they both can be dangerous, how you should respond if you get caught in one is different than how you should respond if you get caught in a rip current. So now I'm going to pass this off to the lifeguards to let them explain more. Hi, my name is Kaylee Gostro. I am the captain for the Cameron County Beach Patrol. And today I'm going to talk about longshore currents and how they move south to north and north to south. What's really important to know about these longshore currents is that they're not the same as rip currents. So longshore currents generally move with the wind, but that's not always the case. If you do find yourself stuck in a longshore current, the most important thing is to stay calm. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to swim towards the shoreline. And of course, that's if you can, just stay calm, ask for help.